हेलो क्राफ्टर्स दिस इज शिवानी हेयर वेलकम टू माय चैनल शिवानी क्रिएशंस टुडे आई एम शोइंग यू हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस वेरी क्यूट मिनी एल्बम और स्क्रैप बुक व्हिच इज मेड यूजिंग वेस्ट बॉक्स सो आई विल शो यू हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस ब्यूटीफुल फोम फ्लावर एंड व्हेन यू विल ओपन इट यू विल गेट डिफरेंट फ्लैप्स टू ऐड लॉट्स ऑफ फोटोज एंड मैसेजेस इनसाइड दिस and i have added all handmade papers pattern papers to decorate it so without any further delay let's start with procedure for this we need iron glue gun ruler flat brush pencil ball tool yellow and orange soft oil pastel finger dauber or sponge wire pollens liquid glue any acrylic color or chalk paint foam pad tweezer any flower punch scissor some foam sheets and any waste box first i'm taking this 10 cm wide strip from this box like this so this is having 31.5 by 10 cm measurement now from the left side i am scoring it on 7 cm 8 18 19 20 5 and 29.5 cm now fold all the creases like this now i'm taking one more 10 by 10 cm cardboard piece and i will connect this piece with this side okay now to connect both the parts with each other i am taking this connector which measures 10 by 2 cm just fold this connector in half and chop the corners now using this connector just connect both these parts using glue so this is done now this side is having only 7 cm width and all these remaining parts are having 10 cm width so to create this part also 10 cm i am taking this 3 cm uh, cardboard piece i have already connected this connector with this so this cardboard piece measures 3 by 10 cm so now just add little glue and connect both the parts so in this way you can extend your flaps in any size of your choice so this is done now this whole panel measures 44.5 by 10 cm so this is completely done now i am taking three more cardboard pieces which measures 9 by 10 cm and i will connect these flaps like this okay for this also i am taking three connectors which measures 10 by 2 cm and i have chopped the corner already so just connect all three flaps like this
now i am taking this chalk paint this is wine color chalk paint if you don't have chalk paint you can use any acrylic color or poster color to color this i am using chalk paint because this is very smooth and very easy to use So this is done. I have just colored the border of all panels because after all we will add pattern paper on top of this so there is no need to cover whole area with color. So it's on you. So I have colored from both the sides. Okay. Now I am taking some pattern papers which are completely handmade and if you want to learn how to create these pattern papers I have given link in description box you can check there. Now I am connecting these pattern papers on each and every flap. Now here I am adding this pocket, on this I have connected 3 connectors on 3 sides and on top I am adding first one pattern paper. Then before adding pocket I am adding this plain paper in the bottom. And now I am just connecting the pocket. So all pattern papers have been added. Now I am adding the magnet in different parts so that we can easily close our album. So I am just adding double sided tape on top of this magnet. Just secure it. And similarly on other side I am adding one piece of double sided tape. Remove the liner and connect second magnet now just close this so it will work like it add one more piece of double sided tape on top of this magnet and 
now to cover this i am adding piece of pattern paper in the same way i am adding pattern paper on top portion so this is done now i am decorating this using some border design this is a punch border like this now here i am adding one strip on which i have connected one border design so you can use this as a pocket to add any photo or tags anything here i am adding one triangle pocket so i have already added connectors with this just connect this triangle pocket on the middle flap So in this way you can decorate the scrapbook or album in any pattern of your choice. So there is no rule. You are free to experiment with yourself. So the basic scrapbook pattern is ready. Now I will show you how to decorate this. So to create foam flowers, I have already created two six petal flowers. The bigger flower is having Six centimeter diameter, and the smaller flower is having four centimeter diameter. Now I am cutting each petal towards the center little bit, and between each petal, cut one more time. So you will get total twelve petals. Now I am shaping each petal. and creating 12 petal flower like this in the same way i will do with small one now I'm taking my plastic poly bag and taking some orange and yellow soft oil pastel. Take sponge daubers. First, I am adding little orange color on the edge of flower from both the sides. Now taking little yellow and adding in the center part of the flower like this in the same way do with small one now to shape the petal just take one petal on the iron and pinch in the bottom like this so do this process with all petals so it will look like this complete this whole flower and in the same way i will do with other flowers so all shaping is done now i'm just pushing in the center using ball tool to create it like cuppy shape now take any sharp object i'm using my tweezer to make hole in the center so this is done now 
I have punched this yellow color foam using this flower punch. This is five petal flower. Now take the flower on iron and just leave it. So you will get small cuppy flower. And I have created this four petal flower. Just hold on iron and leave it. And just push in the center from back side. So you will get this beautiful filler flower. In the same way, I have created some filler flowers and some small buds. Create hole in the center of all flowers. I am connecting wire pollen in the center of the flower using hot glue. Like this. In the same way, I am connecting with the bud. And to create leaf, I have already cut the leaf shape using green color foam and connecting this wired pollen and pinching from the bottom. So leaf is also ready. Now I am creating the flower. So I have already added the bunch of some thread pollens and pearl in the center of the flower. And now I am adding each and every layer of flower one by one. So I am starting with the smallest flower and after small flower I will connect all large shape flower. The beautiful flower is ready. Now take your scrapbook. I am taking this frame which I have created using border punch and added one peach color square paper on this so you can add any photograph or write any message inside this. So first I am connecting this frame. Then cut the excess wire from the flower and before adding flowers I will connect leaves and some filler flowers. So I have just created the group of leaf by just joining the wires with each other. In the same way I have added filler flowers with each other. Now in the center I am adding my big foam flower let it dry so the beautiful handmade scrapbook is ready and this is made using unused box and also all the pattern papers are handmade I have added one belt here to add any photograph like this and in the same way inside the scrapbook I have added some punched pockets to add photographs or tags. The beautiful scrapbook is ready.
I'm sure you will try it very soon. And this is very easy and very quick to make. So my project is done for today. Hope you enjoyed my video. Please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos. And don't forget to click on bell icon for the latest updates. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.